Foundation Pro began in 1996 with the goal of providing professional grade repair with an emphasis on customer service and integrity that our customers can depend on. Our goal at the end of the job is to have the property in the same condition cosmetically as when we started, except now the foundation is supported and stabilized. We say that our equipment and experience makes the difference. That is why we provide education classes and safety classes also to our employees. We learn a lot from our customer satisfaction surveys, but also you know, in online reviews. And, and, and when we receive things like that, we share them with the whole staff. One of the most difficult tasks um, as professionals is reviewing ourselves, reviewing our staff, but those types of things are how we grow. As far as a piece of advice that I could give to someone would be don't isolate yourself. Reach out to other companies, suppliers and professionals with an open mind. Stay active in your community. And if you're local, you're going to see the difference and goodwill comes back. The Better Business Bureau has been a, a guiding light for us. Hi, my name is Steve Cook, and along with my wife, Jolene, I'm the owner of Precision Door Service of Central Arkansas. Precision Door Service uh, repairs garage doors. We fix garage doors right the first time. We have been in business in Little Rock for about five years. When we send a technician into someone's home, we want that homeowner to be very comfortable with the technician, to know a little bit about him. We want that technician to take care of that customer as if it was their own mother. We always go the extra mile to take care of the customer. We do not tolerate shortcuts. We stand behind what we do. We stand behind our employees. Even if we've had an employee that's no longer with us, we stand behind the work that employee did. We've got a reputation to maintain in the marketplace and we just have to do what's right. We bring our staff together every week, every Wednesday morning. Then we talk about things that have went well during the past week and things that could go better. First off, when we start our training, a technician, a prospective technician will ride with one of our other technicians, starting off with our director of field operations, riding and learning the job, because it is a personal approach that makes customers happy with what we're doing. Our mission statement says that people make people happy, it's not products. We had a little store in Ireland, and I think that's where I learned it from my mom and dad, is that sell your products on their own merits, not on the demerits of others. It results in just, there's a, there's a better form of trust. We always talk, it all, always begins with trust. It begins very simply by even answering the phone. Answer the phone with a smile. Within a matter of, of seconds, they're going to know whether I can trust this guy. And ultimately, they're inviting you into a home. To me, that's a tremendous responsibility. So that's why we let our reviews talk for themselves. That's tremendous. But it's also lets you know that you are one poor job away from somebody taking that away from you. So before I even ask for a check, I ask for an exit poll. Ultimately, then we get to the question of, did we treat your home with respect? Is there anything that you saw that could help us to improve? And we get tremendous feedback on things that we should have done, things that we have said in our presentation that maybe we, we glossed over, but it's only by having the customer tell us that is how we learn. But you've got to be fearless in your own commitment to be number one. If I could say above all else, I have a 1% rule. And what I ask you to do is look at something every single day of the week and improve on it by just 1% and see where that takes you. In 2012, we came up with the idea of forming a construction company. When we first started, we made so many mistakes. So uh, we partner with GAF, it's North America's largest roofing manufacturer. And with that, they brought so much technology right at our hands. So we're able to do a drone inspections with artificial intelligence. And along with that, we can take eight pictures of any property and build a 3D model and be able to perform an estimate on every single facet. So we get every single measurement of that property within hours. In construction, there's so many variables that you have no control over. But we have one very foundational principle. If everything goes right, it's on our team. If anything goes wrong, it's on us. We always say that we never lose, we either win or we learn. Ethics is really about morals and principles, so we try to be very transparent and open from the beginning with all of our employees and our subcontractors. 
You have to make sure that your yes means yes and you do it, even if it hurts. The Better Business Bureau provides a great platform for fairness. Now for us contractors, any kind of business can come to the Better Business Bureau and get accredited and say, where well, there's ever an issue, we could solve that issue. When we have a new patient come into the office, we are you know, very honored that they have chosen us. There are a lot of places that they can go. So we try to give them a little bit of you know, our values here. We do a lot of fun things for them. They love patient of the month. Our goal is to not have anybody wait more than 10 minutes. And if you do, you know, that's on us. We And we really value their time. And in order to just ensure that we are doing that, if they wait longer than 10 minutes, we call them to the front, apologize, and we give them what we call an oops card, which is a five or $10 card. So they can go get coffee on us at Starbucks or a drink at Sonic or something like that. Every morning we have a morning huddle that lasts five or 10 minutes. All of our team leaders bring a report to the meeting and we, it really prepares us for the day. Here at Arkansas Family Dental, we are very you know, proud of all the employees that we have here. As they come in, we have them make an appointment as a new patient so they can go through and see what, what the patient goes through. Because it, it always helps to understand what everybody on the other side is doing or feeling, what they see and what they experience. So our new our employees need to go through that new patient experience so that we can improve ourselves, but also so that they can understand and they can help the new patient um, na navigate that also. So we really enjoy giving back to the community. Last November we hosted, um, our we started, it's our first annual, it's called Dentistry from the Heart, but we opened our clinic up for the entire day and we just did free dental services. Um, it's just good to get out in the community and um, spend time with people that have been so good to us and that come and support us. And it just helps just solidify. We have so many different teams and it puts us all together and puts us working towards the same goals for that day. Um, and it just sets us up for success.